This one here is one that I sold. I look back now and I wonder why I ever even thought I was an artist because the art that I was doing was not that good. It was out like this. I was painting like other artists. And so there was nothing special about me. People would not recognize it as my art, different from anybody else's art. It was just nice art. Yeah, don't let this get on you. I made a conscious decision then that if I was going to do this seriously and make a name for myself, that I really had to develop a style of my own. So I started experimenting. Okay, I'm gonna start right, right in the middle with you guys. Yeah. For me, there was nothing sacred about anything. I would just try everything to see what the paint would do if I did things that other artists didn't do. I want you to get down on your knees facing that way. Most other artists would never think uh, of mixing an oil-based paint with a water-based paint and making them both soupy wet. But, but that's what came out of all this experimentation. And, and it gave me a very liquidy style. So what I do is I mix water-based paint, which I put on first, and, and make it really soupy because I paint flat on a table. And then while the water-based paint is still liquid, I start putting oil-based paint on top of it, and I paint with a stick instead of a brush, because a stick will let the oil-based paint run off of it readily. A brush is meant to hold the paint on. Everybody is, is a different color. It will start mixing and flowing, uh, and it becomes half me painting it and half the paint painting itself. I'm not really a manager of the brush. I'm a manager of the paint. It's gonna bleed. It's like opening a gate and letting the sheep out. A farmer who's done it enough times will have a pretty good idea of where those sheep are gonna go and, and how they're going to flow and this way and that way. Well, that's what I started learning about the paint. I didn't necessarily control it. I just knew what it would do, so I would set it in motion in a particular way that allowed me to say, I did that. Look how fast you know, it happened. It is an adventure. Every single time I start a painting, it's an adventure. All of these things make life exciting for me every single day when I'm painting.